if hypothetically you rape a girl and you murder her, and if the court of law in this world cannot prove, and then you truly repent, will Allah forgive you? And you say most probably Allah will forgive you. And you're right. If you have committed, if you have committed rape and murder, and if you truly repent and ask for forgiveness, as I told, there are five criteria required for forgiveness. Number one is you admit what you have done is wrong, that the sin that you have done is wrong, admit it. Number two, see to it that you stop it immediately. Number three, see to it that you don't do it again. Number four is that you ask forgiveness from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. So if all these criteria are fulfilled, inshallah I'll forgive you. Even if you have committed rape, which is a major sin, and if you have uh, <laughs> committed murder, it's a major sin. But if you truly repent, Allah will forgive you. As we know, Allah is Rahman Rahim. Now coming to your second question, that is this not injustice to the girl who was raped and murdered? And I would say no. Because both the person who raped is undergoing a test in this world, the person who was raped also is undergoing a test. And let me explain to you that Allah has given guidelines to the woman that they should dress up modestly, they should cover their complete body, except those parts can be seen that is the face. Now if, if after giving all these guidance, and hypothetically, if that girl doesn't dress up modestly, she is dressed up immorally, which people get excited and the rape is done, who's to blame? It is even the girl to blame. That doesn't mean that the boy has a right to rape. But besides the boy who committed the rape and murdered, it is the girl who also has to follow the guidelines of the Quran. If she wore obscene clothes because of which the rape took place, then she is responsible. But if she wore normal clothes and yet if the person rapes, then it is a test for the girl. For the girl, was she following the advice of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala by wearing appropriate clothes or not? If she was not, then she is to blame to attract the men to rape her. 